Hi guys, uh, just a quick midweek update for the Snap auction which is going to happen on Friday. Now um, the idea is there's going to be a normal news show on Friday as you know. Uh, hopefully that will be up sort of early evening in the UK. Usually I tend to put it up around about 6 o'clock um, sort of British time. Now the thing is I'm going to then put on a live show which will be on at 9 o'clock that evening which I will probably run it for about an hour okay till about 10 o'clock and at the end of it obviously we can announce who the winners actually are so you can bid live whilst I'm on air as well okay so if you members who know about the live streaming anyway you know there's this area in the forum but also if you just go onto uh, the actual uh, main site itself on today's page it'll be a nice big screen which you can watch me live on there as well. Now, you can probably see down here, this is auction one, okay? I'm just gonna recap what's really in there. Obviously, um, both auctions are gonna come with lifetime members uh, shipped to the site, so that's it forevermore. Uh, you become a lifetime member, get your little badge on the actual forum and everything else like that. You're also gonna get, um, obviously, full sets of washes, sanders, the entire sanding range, as you know, and my goodie bag system, which we covered in the video, which you've obviously seen, which has got everything like the metalizers and all the Tamiya tapes and putties and all those things uh, that, you know, really are a help, okay? You've also got the kits down there, that's including the book, there's the Evolution airbrush and all the bits and pieces you can hopefully see just down here behind me, okay? Now, over the last few days, you lot have been really, really generous this week including poor old Russ and Lee uh, and their lad who got stuck in seven and a half hours to bring us some kits, which you'll see in a moment as well, down to us. Also, um, Steve uh, Malley, he's been back here again with some more goodies for you. So uh, we've got even more to add to the thing. So I'm gonna run you through auction two, okay, which I think is at around about 575 pound at the moment, but we've got some other bits and pieces to show you. So if I just move the hind out of the way. Um, we've got a selection of the lock-on books, so great references from there, okay. We've also got, uh, if I go through what's new, uh, we've got the uh, AFE Club, uh, we've got the Churchill here kit, uh, a lovely kit like that, okay. We've got the F4 Phantom, Hasegawa one. We've got the Ravel Lynx, okay. We've got the Royal Resin Class Eddard Spitfire, beautiful, that's got the glass on it and all the rest of it. Okay, uh, what else we got? We've got the uh, Hellcat, Wildcat, uh, F6, is it? Yeah, F6F. Okay, one of those. And then we've also got, I'm just trying to think what's new in the pile here. We've also got in here, um, courtesy of uh, Steve on the site, Suckling, a selection of prints. Okay, uh, I'll show you these live on air uh, and in the proper news show, but there's a few in there, and there's a few prints that I've had lying around as well from some of the squadrons that I've been with and things like that. So there's some of those to look at. We've also got a beautiful book on the Harrier. Okay, brand new hardback book, uh, and it's the, the history of the Harrier. We've also got Mosquito 148 Skit Tamiya. Beautiful kit. We've also got the new, which it is. Hey, look, I can do this with it. It's here. Okay, we've got the Tornado kit, brand new, unopened. We've also got a Hawk. We've also got, reviewed by my good self a couple of weeks ago, the Apache. This is the A36 fighter, uh, also known as a Mustang. <laughs> We've got in here, which is a great kit because I've built one before, which is falling out of the box. Uh, we've got here the beautiful large Sabre jet, absolutely cracking. Also, heads up, we'll be doing this one hopefully next year. I have an idea for that one. We have also on the Tornado theme, we've got another 132nd Tornado. It's the ECR kit and the Tiger Meats, which is very nice. And, which we do have to thank Rust and Lee for, because a few of these kits are theirs, including this monster. So we've got here, this is the Tamiya F4E 32nd kit. Anybody who knows their Phantoms will know this is probably the finest 132nd kit there is. Okay, so it's a great one like that. Plus all the other bits and pieces as well. So there is more in that kit collection. So as you can see, I've got a massive stash of kits and everything going on behind me and everything else like that. Now, the bidding currently, auction one is up to 1,600. Thank you very much for that one. Absolutely fantastic. Auction 2 is currently lying at £575 as well and we've had loads of checks through the post as well direct to me for uh, donations direct to Snap as well which I've already passed those on uh, and everything else so thank you very much to all of you. As I say it's a great thing we've had to split it in two purely because it's so big. 
otherwise shipping this lot I might as well take it in the pickup myself uh, to take it to where it's got to go but certainly I'm shipping it worldwide so if you want to bid on it as I say really straightforward either through the contact me on the actual main site or obviously via the forum PMs Facebook you know all the ways you can normally get hold of me anyway but as I was going to say Friday is the day um, as I say I'm going to do the normal news show which I'll record in the morning it will obviously be in HD and all the rest of it and then nine o'clock is going to start um, which is British uh, summertime still um, so depending where you're on the world uh, US I think you're five hours behind me or eight hours depending where you are uh, and things like that or obviously you're in front but it's going to run for about an hour but you know what we're like when we get yapping we might go on a little bit more fully interactive so you'll be able to contact me direct as we go the way through and hopefully we can have your bids building up throughout the evening to give snap something really big uh, at the end of it but I must thank everybody for the amount of kits and stuff you've donated um, you know it's been amazing literally every single day this week I've had something come through the post uh, with a little note saying for snap and all the rest of it so thank you very very much don't send any more i'd love to take it and go my stash then no it won't um, i don't know lots of you have come up with a rather um suggestions and things like that so we're definitely going to do something like this again in the future uh, but for the moment please don't send any more because it's a little bit too late now for doing this type of thing obviously if you do want to make a direct um, snap donation checks made out to snap um, and then just send them to me and then i can pass them on with your goodwill and everything else like that so until Friday, everybody, happy modeling and take care.